News Live at 6. I know he's going to pull through and everything will be all right. A Fargo family is pulling together after receiving disheartening news last week. A North Fargo cadet is battling a brain tumor. He had his first round of surgery yesterday with a second round to follow Friday. But he's not in it alone. Valley News Team's Courtney Lockie explains how his fellow ROTC cadets are stepping up to show their support. This is Cadet Thompson. He's a freshman at Fargo North. He joined the ROTC program in August. Just humor all the time. He's, he has a really nice laugh and he's just funny. His classmates spoke of his kindness and his work ethic, saying he's always the first one ready to go to work. <laughs> so when he didn't show up for training last week, they knew something was off. He was on the same PT team with me, and he was just not there and all of a sudden. After having vision problems in class, his mom took him to the doctor. When mama gave us the news, I was just kind of like in shock. Doctors found a tumor on Cadet Thompson's brain. It's only been a week, not even a week, so everything is still very fresh and raw, and you really don't have words. He had surgery Monday and is doing okay. ROTC is just one big family, so you have a lot of people supporting you. After Cadet Thompson said he was worried about having to shave his head, the leaders of ROTC decided it was something he wasn't going to do alone. In support of Cadet Thompson, I will be shaving my head just um, because I want to show solidarity and show that I care. There are over 20 others so far, cadets from Davies, Fargo North and South, all jumping on the bandwagon. We're here for you. We're not leaving you. We leave no one behind. And they'll be donating the locks to an organization that makes wigs for kids who have critical illnesses. As for our cadet Thompson, he has another round of surgery on Friday to remove the rest of the tumor. Stay strong. I know you're going to get through this. You have a ton of support behind you, and we're ready for you to come back anytime you're ready. In Fargo, Courtney Lockie, Valley News Live. When Thursday rolls around at 4.30 in the afternoon, all of those cadets will be shaving their heads at South Fargo High School if you'd like to come out and show your support.